plastic waste accumulates over time when improperly disposed, which creates a long-lasting negative effect on our environment. The later roads block drainage networks, sewers, and harm marine habitats. Plastic recycling lowers the risk of environmental damage by reprocessing the material into useful products. Itisa Bashiri Korfi, a green architect and managing partner at Ifrit Eco Solutions, shed light on turning plastic bags into paving tiles. The whole idea of making the bricks is because of the plastic waste that is everywhere in the world, not only in Nigeria or in Abuja. So we tried to see how we are going to bring a solution to that plastic pollution. It's not for building, it's for, for you to lay as walkways or for your landscaping. But for the one for using as bricks for building, we are still in research process of how we can produce that one too. First, we collect the waste plastic from so many places, markets, schools, and most places where you can find refuse dumps. After collecting it, we take it to our factory. We sort it. We need them clean and dry. After drying, we melt them. After melting them, we mix with sand, pigment, then put them inside a mold, what we call a mold. For now, we are using a basic method of producing them manually. Then we just let them dry and we can lay them immediately. On, unlike the other conventional one, which you have to wait for 28 to 30 days for it to cure. Plastic bricks possess numerous advantages over conventional bricks. Um, this plastic don't degrade early in the environment. So because of that property of plastic that stays longer in the earth before degrading, that is why it lasts longer than the concrete um, pavers that is being produced. If you are going to use the concrete pavers, when you produce them, you have to wait for like 28 days to be watering it to, to um, a process called curing before you can lay them. But this one, when you finish them, you can lay them immediately. And um, it's also, we are also contributing to environmental sustainability of taking care of the earth, being custodian too of the earth because it is believed that change starts with you. So by doing that, at least you will reduce waste that is supposed to go to the um, waterways to block it and cause flooding or waste that is supposed to go to the rivers and these um, marine animals which will feed on them and at the end of the day we'll buy it and you know we feed on the plastic too it causes so many sicknesses so it has that environmental advantage also Ifrit Eco Solution intends to build capacity of both the private and public sector in terms of plastic brick making as a solution to environmental pollution. Yes, we believe that we can solve the problem of plastic alone. We we want to train as many people as possible to do this um, products too, and um, we are open to training people you know, government and um, private parastatals on this um, brick making because we have this plastic waste everywhere in parts of the country, every country, every, every parts of the world. So we got so many interests from government, in the, um, government agencies and private individuals on how we can train people. So we have a um, model now that we have to train people that are interested in learning it. We hope to have our, you know, centers in all the ge six geopolitical zones and some West African countries so that we'll, we'll have a place of, a process of tackling this plastic pollution that is disturbing the world. <music>